Good morning. Good morning. We're leaving Port of Princessa. Yeah, our time here has come to an end. Yeah, we're waiting for our van on the way to Port Parteau. Bring it on. So we're here, we arrived, we're in Port Barton. So guys, we've arrived. We're in Port Barton. Oh God, it's so peaceful. Man, that's rustic here. Yeah. So peaceful. That's what we wanted to experience. Yeah, so, no, we're yeah. standing in a little sort of shack hut type thing, aren't we? Yeah. The roads are actually very decent and they're being yeah. made wider. Made wider, because so obviously... So you can see they're future-proofing yeah. for more tourism here. I don't think um, this town actually realises what's in from in I the know, next couple of years. Oh, such a shame. They're now starting to build the first resort in San Vicente, which is north of Port Barton. So, so if you want to come and see Port Barton before... It all changes. Yeah, come now, guys. Definitely. Uh, uh, So we've got children's playing basketball, children riding motorbikes about. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's cool, really sort of... Rustic, yeah, local life. Village in the middle of a jungle. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. This is one of, this is the reason why we've come to Palawan. Yeah. To Port Barton. You said, didn't you, if yeah. there was one place you would come in the Philippines. It was going to be Port Barton, yeah. yeah. This is the place I was most interested about. So let's see if it lives up to expectation, guys. <laughs> So, wow, <laughs> first impression of Port Barton, wow, <laughs> really peaceful side streets, we've just walked down to this beach and look at it here. People rave about Philippines. And this is the reason why, guys. Yeah, it is. Um, and this is the reason why this is going to be flooded in a few years' time, which yeah. is a shame. But I'm glad we've got to what cute... come and have a look ourselves. This, this is sort of like what this... dreams are made of, Yeah, no? this is what they call paradise. Yeah, I think so. This is... Incredible. A tiny little fishing village. Yeah, amazing. Wow. Beautiful. So we just freshened up. God, it feels peaceful, doesn't it? Yeah, well, nice here, oh, man. It's so chill, really it's nice. So chilled out here. <laughs> Sun's now starting to go down, the best part of the day. Oh, I love it and when uh, there's yeah, that chill evening. Get really vibe. chill vibe, yeah. Especially when you're somewhere like this. Oh, yes. <laughs> Let's see what Port Barton has to offer at night. So, have the Philippines got the best beaches in the world? So far, so paradise. Oh yeah. Mm. 
evening. So we've come down to the beach this evening to watch the sun drop. Yeah. And maybe have a cheeky beer. Cheeky beer. Or a little cocktail. Ah. If my husband lets me. Just because you're in the Philippines. But it's more fun here. Is there more cocktails in the Philippines though? I don't know, it must be if it's more fun in the Philippines. Mm, right, you better see about that then, eh? Now guys, that's what I call a sunset. Oh man, I don't know what to say, that was absolutely beautiful. It's margarita time guys. I haven't got a margarita. What have I got? Oh, Mai Tai. Mai Tai time. Oh, beautiful bay, sun going down, well cocktail chilled. in hand. Great company. Amen to that. So Port Barton's got a oh. bit of a backpacker's yeah, boho right. sort of vibe going on at the moment. I don't know how long that's been going on, um, but how so relaxing. So chuffed we've stopped by yeah. here. Four you, nights we're Four here, nights, boss. we're going to chill right down. down. Yeah, yeah, this feels good. Yeah, we need a bit of that after yeah. Manila, hey? <laughs> Here we are guys in Port Barton. At we... Gorgonzola pizza joint, four or four cheese in my belly. Oh my god, god. How <laughs> keep this going? Well, what can I say? It's definitely the biggest pizza I've ever had in my life. It's mental, man. <laughs> How are we gonna read all this? Oh, that is lovely. Is it? Mm. This is huge, guys. <laughs> Gorgonzola, Port Barton. You've got to come here. Yeah. You can get a margarita for five, seven pounds. That's about a 40 to 50 inch pizza. And it's great, they've got a wood fired oven here. Mm. And they've got a couple of cute dogs who, who are hungry. Hey, huh? Carl's got the torch out. I've got the torch out because we are in a village yeah. in the countryside. So local here. Yeah, so local. Yeah. But lovely. I'm so chilled out here. I can't wait to chill down in bed, go to yeah. sleep with nature, wake up with nature. We're standing in a little hut. I and know. Uh, yeah, We've like got the this resident gecko and he's all This lizard. gecko was barking. And he's barking at us, man. We went in there, we thought it was a cockerel or a dog. I know. This, hopefully, we can film it for you guys. If we can find him. He's always there. He's been there all day. He's always there. Which is good if he eats a mosquito, he saves us getting malaria. I'm waiting for that lizard. You gotta hear this lizard, guys, because I want to know what type of lizard. We're waiting for that lizard. Is it a poisonous lizard or is it a lizard or is it a. Come on, guys, where's that lizard? Come on, lizard. That sounds like a growling dog. Did you hear that? Leave in the comments below what that is. We're sleeping with that for the next four days. Anyway. This concludes our first day and evening in Port Barton. Please subscribe, comment, share. Good night and we'll see you in the morning.